Six years ago, three families in our town Assumption went to an economic development meeting, not sure where it would lead. Little did they know they would soon open up a, a unique business right in the middle of town. WCI3's Amanda Brennan is with us. So Amanda, what are they brewing up? 1905 Brewery is creating over a dozen different kinds of beer. It's drawing in people from near and far to come try out a new drink, hang out with friends, and enjoy food trucks with live music. Above all, the owners are keeping their roots local and tying in parts of the town to each beer you sip. One day we just decided let's, uh, let's, let's build a brewery. So with absolutely no experience, that's what Craig Collins, his wife, and two other couples did in our town assumption. I had found an article on some successful towns down in Mississippi, and the common denominator to all those small towns was they all had microbreweries in them. We opened in May of 2018, and in 2019, February, we had a fire that, that burnt to the ground. Then, after taking some time to rebuild, they opened their doors in a new location just down the street. We kind of picked uh, types of beer that we like and tried to recreate them in our, and put our own little touch to them. The brewing process starts in the wee hours of the morning. We start at the far tank as our hot liquor tank. We, th we throw water in there in the morning, get it up to about 170 degrees and transfer it over to the middle tank, which is our mash tun. That's what we dump in the grain and the specialty malts. After that, the water cycles through the grain. It's transferred to another kettle before ending in the fermentation tanks, kegs, and your glasses. We have 20 on tap at all times. Occasionally we'll run out of a little bit. We've done about 32, 33 total different brews, uh, and they range from stouts and porters to uh, we have one sour on tap. Uh, we have ales and uh, IPAs. Behind each beer lies a creative name attached to a story from the town. Some of them, uh, yeah, are, are something that happened in the town, like Slag Pile Stout. Um, that was, there was a slag pile in town from the old coal mine. Uh, Big George Porter, our number one beer, is uh, a creek that runs through town, a drainage tile creek. Our town assumption has always had 1905 breweries back each step of the way. Uh, the community supports us absolutely, but the region does as well. And uh, it's pretty gratifying to build something and create something and then have somebody enjoy it. It's kind of neat to see that we can bring people from out of town into, you know, a small town like Assumption. And you can check them out on Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, or if you're catching a show at Decatur's Devon Amphitheater, try their Skinny Deep Dipper APA on draft. Back to you. All right. Maybe we can do that on Friday? I don't know. Yeah. Mm, maybe after we're done with the newscast. <laughs> when we're out there. No, you should taste test it while during the newscast. That would be more fun. Can we? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm going to tell the boss you said Okay. So. There we go. Sounds been good. Excited. Yeah. I might even have to make a trip out there. <laughs> Suddenly, the Fred's right, coming. Illinois football coming up. They start training camp tomorrow. But, you know, if, if it's free beer tasting, I might have to go out there.